Five new games that can get you free real Robux. Game one is called Avatar Island. This is an outfit donation game used to create outfits or get inspired by players to earn Robux from others. You can also donate to others for their outfits. And this player has even gone and raised 230,000 Robux completely for free through this game. And this seems to be a live donation ticker to go and find out all of the most recent donations. And some people are willing to donate quite a bit. Now let's actually go and test this game out. Someone literally just donated me four Robux. And honestly, I don't know how or why yet. But underneath your avatar, you can actually go and see every single game pass that you have for sale. So if someone wants to casually just donate me like 10 million Robux or something, then I guess you can. This person right here has raised zero Robux, so let's go and test out how this game works and just give some free Robux away. I think this is more targeted towards people who want to dress up their avatars with the Robux. But there we go, it is raining Robux for them. And they said thank you, there we go, they have got their first ever Robux reward. Now I can actually see this being a pretty popular game. It kind of gives people an incentive to going and buying stuff as you can kind of tell people what you want to buy, I think. But there we go. I guess we are on the list. So people do regularly donate if I just donated and all of these people have already gone and donated since. So if you want some free Robux to decorate your avatar, then check out this game. The next game is called NPC Tips. Let's check it out. The idea behind this game is to kind of do a role play and receive tips, which would be Robux. So it seems that you're pretending to go and work in some type of coffee shop. And then right here, you can see something called a tip jar. So if I press this, you can actually tip people Robux, which is definitely interesting. I think the whole thing is like a role play thing. I honestly don't know if this person is just like actually typing this or not. And then I guess you select what you want. I, I don't know. I'm just going to say I would like a slushy. I don't really understand how this game works. And if they are now going to get me a slushy, I don't, I don't know. What flavor slushy? I would like a cookie flavored slushy. If you can't provide, then you're not getting a tip to be fair. There is no way they actually have a cookie flavored one. What size cup? big. If they genuinely have a cookie slushy, I'm going to be very concerned. They said, okay, they're just running off to go and make my drink. What in the world? Honestly, I don't know what's going on back there, but I think this is some type of role play game. Slash give cookie cutter. Did I, did I actually get it? I, I don't think so. Oh my word. Cookie dough slushy. What? That is actually what this says. How did they make that? What in the world? Okay, that's a very strange game. So I guess you can actually tip them real Robux. So let's go and buy this. What am I buying? What did I just buy? Uh, purchase of this was succeeded. Enjoy your Robux. Look at you. Hopefully they're happy. Okay, they actually are happy. So I am glad that we can surprise people by literally just giving them Robux. As to actually how much Robux you can make playing this game, I'd say it's pretty limited. Now let's check out the next game called Please Judge. A donation game where you gotta judge people on their skills. I think the idea behind this game is you've got a plea as of why you think this person deserves Robux. But this person currently isn't even selling anything. And in the same way, you can just go over to people's tip jars and give them Robux. This guy is playing the piano, and in return, he's kind of hoping that we're just going to go and give him some free Robux by just simply clicking on the Game Pass and purchasing it. So I'm going to say the first person to tell me a joke, he gets some free Robux. As just sitting here does absolutely nothing. Knock knock, who's that? I, I want to know what the joke is. Hashtags. Your. Mom. Well, I'm not sure she'll approve of this, but I'll give you some free Robux. Yeah, I guess that joke deserves two Robux, guys. Just to test it, let's go and give them some free Robux and see what they say. And they said thank you. So I guess the idea is you say jokes and do different talents. And once you're on the stage, you can try and earn free Robux. Now, if you use voice chat, this could actually be pretty entertaining. This could be some type of like comedy club or you could actually show a genuine skill to win Robux. So now I'm on the stage. Basically, you just go around saying what you want and uh, asking for Robux pretty much. And someone actually gave me some free Robux. So I guess this does work. You can make some free Robux by going and spending 30 seconds just 
talking, I guess. Next game is called Double Down. Now you're probably wondering how could you possibly get free Robux from this game? Well, you can go and spin this wheel for a chance of going and getting a Robux ticket, which I really hope I demonstrate right now by landing on one, but the odds are very slim as you can see. But say for example you land on a thing that says a 20 Robux ticket. You could then go and start a game of one of these things against another player and actually get Robux. For example, this is a 10 Robux game, and if someone wants to play against me, they buy my 10 Robux game pass. Now all I've got to do is play Rock, Paper, Scissors, and if I win, then I get to do it again and charge someone another 10 Robux. So let's go for Paper. And Paper beats Rock, so I've got the first round. Next, I'm going to choose Rock. So let's hope that they've gone and picked Scissors. And they chose Paper. I'm going to pick Rock again. Fingers crossed. And we actually just destroyed them. It's best of five, so if I get three rounds, then I win. I'm picking Scissors. Please choose Paper. Yes, let's go! I've just gone and doubled my Robux. There we go, you were rewarded a ticket to start another game. So now I've got another 10 Robux one, I could start another game and then they buy the game pass and if you win you can do it again and again and again and you get 10 Robux for free basically every single time that you win. But if you lose then you don't go and get to do it again for free. So it's kind of if you're really lucky and really good at these games that you could actually just keep getting tons of Robux. But it is like a skill game as well. The last game to go and give you some free Robux is my own game. That's right. The Obby but you don't get checkpoints. This game has given away some expensive things such as these Dominus Wings as a code I've given away for free before. And I've also gone and given away completely free Robux considering it's a free free Robux themed obby. Now the thing is I can't go and give away free Robux to every single person that goes and wins this obby as I would be completely broke and I'm pretty sure it would break the Roblox terms of service. So how this works is I go and occasionally host events on this game. And if you're on while I am on, I will go and do a host of an event. And if you win, you get sent a Robux code. That's right, like an actual gift card code. That's the only way that it is allowed according to Roblox rules, I'm pretty sure. The same way that Hazem did a free Robux obby, which currently doesn't work. Basically, when I do these events, if you win the obby, the first person to do it would then go and get a uh, free Robux gift card. But feel free to go and play this game in your free time if you want to go and practice for when I go and do these events. Because I'll be making another one of these events pretty soon where I give away some more free Robux if you're interested. Let us know your favorite free Robux game down below in the comments and which one you're going to play. Still got no Robux? Check this video here to find out how to get free Robux in 2023, the real other method.